What's up, everybody? Ron Blue back again with another video for you guys. So if you're clicking this video, you probably already know what I'm going to talk about today. And that's no other than the announcement that was made a few hours ago. Let's just say maybe about two hours ago, maybe going on three hours now. Um, and that was that uh, Mike McGreedy is from Pearl Jam is going to be um, collabing with Fender's custom line. So basically, he has a signature limited edition custom line, uh, 1960 Strat. Um, and essentially, it's the exact same uh, scratches, dings, even down to the headstock. Um, the custom shop really paid close attention to the actual guitar to remake it to where he didn't even notice in the video that he wasn't playing his own guitar and that he was um, playing the... Uh, custom line or the replica whatever you want to call it but um so i was doing some digging to see what the estimated price may be and it was rumored that it was going to be fifteen thousand dollars and it's not really surprising with it being a fender custom shop especially with them uh, being partners um with this particular guitar um all the work that he's done in the 90, 90s and to almost um, be give a, almost or I'm not going to say almost. I'll say to actually be a huge influence of how we approach rock today um, is all, you know, all praise to Mike McGreedy. And it's awesome that he's still alive and well to be able to get, you know, be in this um, opportunity to be in this predicament for him to be able to partner with such a powerful uh, company. Um, however, uh, $15,000 is way beyond my price range. And I feel like if I had $15,000 just laying around, I probably wouldn't get a guitar. However, um, this guitar, I feel like if you were interested in getting it, I think it's something more so for um, a collection um, a, or a collector, should I say. Um, this, this this guitar, I wouldn't even use as a workhorse guitar. Um, the, the is Oddly enough, when I saw the announcement, um, it made me automatically think about the uh, Kirk Douglas SG um, guitar. Um, that was announced earlier this year and that's with the three pickups um, and it comes in I think a few I think it comes in white almost like a whale blue and a black and gold color um, but it's, it's, it's a really nice it's a really nice guitar and if we're talking about 15,000 or 2,500 dollars obviously my go-to is going to be the 2,500 dollars um, Especially with it kind of almost playing, paying homage to Rosetta Tharp, which is another um, rock and roll uh, legend, um, which I'm sure Mike knows of, and you know, and and so it goes. But um, price range, at least I feel like the benefits of a Kirk Douglas guitar signature guitar is that you could um you could use that you know you can i would feel comfortable using that as a workhorse guitar and it'll probably age better um as it gets older now with this particular um custom line guitar i think that it's already aged uh it's 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 purposely or intentionally aged to make it look like his guitar However, I'm I'm really not um I, I'm not moved to purchase, you know, something like that. Even if it was in the lower range of a custom line um fender um guitar, which is typically about four or five thousand dollars. Um I've seen some lower scale ones that I feel like I would be moved to purchase over obviously three times that amount. But um, you guys let me know in the comment section, which one would you choose? Would you guys go ahead and choose the um, Kirk Douglas SG by Gibson? Or would you 
like this guitar enough to collect you know um for it to for you to collect it and maybe i mean you know ideally the guitar is meant to be used but i'm just saying like for a price like that i wouldn't want to i wouldn't want to do anything with it i would just collect it if it was given to me i would just collect i would just keep it in a in a safe somewhere like it's like one of those type of guitars where it's like it's cool to have just to say you have it but would i bring it out to a gig or or, or two Pro probably not honestly probably not but you guys let me know in the comments what you guys think about the guitar and uh get back with me um if you enjoyed this video please like share and subscribe to my channel more videos will be coming soon as um news breaks with um these new guitars and things like that i'll try to be on it to give you guys a video and my personal opinion about it and until next time peace